from the metal, creating at some level water that go from the lungs to the kidneys and the mid to lower back. The sound here is and the color associated with water element or the water phase is a deep blue. It might even be a, a deep, beautiful black color, but let's either deep blue or black. Uh, and you're gonna sort of gather, like you're almost like you're swimming, gathering water around to your back. And I'll just show you from the side here. Uh, when you breathe out, you're gonna kind of roll into the back, minding what your back needs here. But kind of rolling back, like accessing the kidneys. You're breathing out and down, eyes open, you only have that sound. And this time, as you gather around you and breathe in, you're gathering this water. Imagine you're gathering blue light, deep blue light back to the kidneys. You touch your mid to lower back to give the sense of you know, kinesthetic reinforcement there. And you're gonna roll into the back and you're gonna breathe out. And this time coming out is gonna be this deep blue mist, maybe like a grayish mist. Just imagine you're sending out whatever needs to be released as you say, the, the emotion uh, that is said to be connected to the kidneys and to the water element, like the water element or the water phase gets stuck or out of balance or where the kidneys are out of balance or the energy is, is, it needs, is stuck. It, it said that one of the emotions that can arise there is fear. So as you breathe out that deep blue mist, imagine you're letting go of fear, any, whether, whether it's overt fear or whether it's uh, you know, sedimented or ancestral fear, however you want to think about it. And for each of these, if, if any piece of it, just to be clear, doesn't feel right, you're like, I don't really want to work with fear right now. That's like my thing. Just, you can just do the color. You can just do the sound. Like these add-ons are just there to play with if it helps. You. All right, so it's going to go like this. So you're going to start, like you're swimming, you're gathering around, you're breathing in this deep blue water, gathering it back to the kidneys, sitting upright, hands on lower back, you're going to breathe out that deep blue mist downward with the eyes open, letting go of fear. You're going to go, shoo, shoo. and again, breathing in. Shoo. One more time, breathing in. Shoo, shoo. Now, I should play this like I meant it pedagogically to do it this way, but I didn't add the full thing in and I, I, just, I just frankly forgot. It's okay, no harm will come to you. There's another piece to this. As you do this, you can either bring the knees together. When I do it by myself, I often will keep the knees out, but the key here is lift your heels up. So kind of press into the balls of the feet. You can bring the balls of the feet a little closer to your chair if you like. The kidney one acupuncture point, it's called the bubbling well or the bubbling spring acupuncture point is the bottom of each foot kind of just behind the ball of the foot. And so this like energetically, physically, symbolically accesses the kidney one acupuncture points as you do this. And then it's gonna feel really awesome. So I'm gonna, I'll do it this time with my knees together. So we'll do those three again. So take a deep breath in, gathering deep blue light to your kidneys. Seeing deep blue mist come out, letting go of fear. And again, You can let the feet go flat again. You can bring the hands back to the knees or whatever. We're not going to, I guess we are going to pause a little bit here. So just come into a comfortable spot. So the water element gives rise to wood. Uh, the element of wood, like vegetation and growth and green things and all of that stuff. So we're following the creation cycle here. We begin with the metal of the lungs. We went to the water of the kidneys. Water gives rise to wood. And so the wood 